All right, y'all. Looks like we got ourselves another wild one. In today's video, we got a disgruntled parent getting ready to lay the smack down at the science fair, y'all. I don't know what's going on. This, this is a PTA meeting. I don't know either way. It's about to turn into a wrestling match if this mother gets her way, y'all. After she claims that this principal done put hands on her, y'all. Nah, 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 nah. That may be a precious angel on the screen, but that baby's mother's on demon time, y'all. Hold on a second, B. You know we got to break this video down. Breathe easy. Easy style. Make sure you hit the like button and subscribe. Let's rock. You are. So you're mad because my daughter. Don't you, you, you oh, touch me. Be a whole she fight. touched get me. I got my her. phone. She Come touched me. No, Come I'm asking her. why my daughter Come damn near has a ball spot in her head. head. You tried to April touch Holt. me. She her just tried to attack me. I have my phone. You tried to attack me. No, she's just trying. No, I know I shouldn't laugh, but it's like she's trying to attack me. I have my phone. She's like, she's damn near beating her across the head with the phone, telling him like, yo, she tried to attack me. And you know what? Hold on, hold on. I don't want to, I, I haven't seen this, but it looked like, I wouldn't call that an attack motion when you're coming at her. You know what I mean? But let's, 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 let's see what's going my on. My phone, you tried to attack me. No, she's just trying to touch me because I recruited her over my child. Over my no, I'm not leaving out because if that was the case and she has a problem, she could have had, I didn't say nothing out the way to you. This is still my kid. This is still my kid. And I will sit here. I will sit here very quietly. She has on a white sweatshirt. You can let them know. You can let them know. She's disrespectful to me. Like, I'm upset. I have every right to record. Don't scratch her head. No, more than saying that her daughter's hair, she had to take it out. My baby had a hole we wanted in her head because of this. All right, there's a big discrepancy here. She's saying that the baby got a ball spot. They saying that there's a little bit of sand in the child's hair, y'all. I, I I don't I don't know what's going on. All right, but 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 overall though, this is definitely coming from the perspective of the parent. You know what I'm saying? She's the one with the camera. She's the one with the narrative. And although I know you definitely don't play about nobody's kids, that's for sure. But it seems like right now, Mama, I'm glad you took that seat. But you're getting like 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 like. Let's talk about this real quick. I do see a lot of yelling coming from your end right now. Yeah. Me, but then again, I don't know what happened prior. Let's see what's going on. Like her scalp is very sensitive. Of course, I'm gonna be upset about it because I asked her several times. And then on top of the fact, what about the mess with him yesterday? Like you just up and tell me. Like I asked before I came here about the after school program and if he was eligible to stay afterwards. That's something that I was told. Totally different. So <laughs> this <laughs> principal's over here like girl my makeup ain't done my hair ain't dead ain't nothing done i ain't even passed no lotion on my elbows how you gonna have me on camera nah 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 this person over here got every right not to want to be on camera b look look at her y'all nah nah i wouldn't want to be on camera either b them elbows about to start a forest fire hey yo get smoking a bear over here right now Drown your campfires with water. Make sure it's totally wet. Then stir and drown again. We know we can count on you to do what Toby says. Only you can prevent forest fires. B, nah, 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 nah. This is a fire hazard if I've ever seen one, B. Put a gallon of water next to this chick, B. Nah, nah, nah. Them elbows is combustible, B. Hold on. So just imagine what type of day I'm having. So if I do raise my voice a little bit, I'm not screaming. I wasn't screaming at her. My anger was more frustrated with my daughter's hair. And it's disrespectful for anybody to find that as a personal reason. She's been having a problem since I came. Since I said something to her this morning about Jeremiah, I politely dropped my daughter off and I came right back to pick her up. That's all. But she doesn't get to be disrespectful to me. a belligerent parent here who's refusing to leave the office. She's recording. I just called 911. She will not leave the office. No, I'm not leaving out of the office because you tried to attack me. You're going You're going to jail. Actually, I have the video, so you call the police. You're going to jail. You tried to attack me. I have it. I have it. She. I have the video. She tried to attack me. It's on my phone because my... 
this parent is like, no, I will be heard. Okay, since you look like she called, I don't know, this is the superintendent. I don't know who this is, the director. I don't know what. But as, as soon as the parents started airing out her grievances, then then the principal started over talking like, nah, nah, nah. <laughs> like, hold on. Mama got out the seat, got in the camera like, nah, we going to photobomb this bad boy. No, no, no. This is a spicy situation. Yeah, I mean, what really touched my heart. Let me see if I can get the frame right here, man. This the, the, this frame right here. Yeah, you know I mean, this the, this image right here kind of make kind of switches my perspective. Yeah, you know I mean, like I don't really know if there's really a ball spot on that kid's head. At the end of the day, man, like get the babies out of there. Yeah, you know I mean, you're raising your voice is getting hostile. Like I remember growing up. Yeah, you know I mean, seeing my parents argue, and that kind of does affect you. You know what I'm saying? Like at a certain point in time, like but then again, she's in the heat of the moment. Yeah, you know I mean, like this is all retrospect, but I'm just saying, like yeah, you know I mean, like that 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 image right there kind of mess with me right there. But hold on a second, let me let me save the commentary. Let's see what's going on. You're going to jail. Actually, I have the video. So you called the police. You're going to jail. You tried to attack me. So I, do I have it. You so I have it. She. I have the video. So she tried to attack me. It's on my phone because my daughter hair is full of sand and it can get infected. Uh, and I asked a question once. My daughter's hair is full of sand. You're doing this because of your daughter's hair was full of sand. Nah, mama. Like, yo, listen, the parents in the chat in the comment section, y'all gotta let me know, man. Is she doing too much? Cause cause we went from we went from a ball spot on the head to now I got uh, my daughter's hair is full of sand. Like if you if your daughter's hair is full of sand, you're doing all of this. I don't know, man. Let, this might be a little bit too much, but hold on a second. Sand and it can get infected. Uh, and and I asked a question. You once. On what's going on. Yeah, She's okay. Still will not leave. No, yeah. I'm not because I want explanations of why my daughter's hair is this way and why did you just try to swing so on me? So. Nah, 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 nah. Listen, man, I gotta give it to y'all. Real deal, holy feel. You know, breathe easy, gotta give you the breakdown, man. Yeah, you know I mean, yeah, if your reasoning is to be there to get answers for what happened, then you need to leave because obviously you're not gonna get those answers. Everybody's in the heat of the moment right now. She's tight, you're tight, everybody's angry. You damn near came to blows. The police have been called. Like, like you need to leave, yo. Like, nah, nah, nah. Like, you know what I mean, I understand the frustrations when it comes to having your kids you know what i'm saying like i get it you know what i'm saying like it's turn up time you kind of black out but at the end of the day you just told me that you're there because you want answers they asked you to leave you said no until you get answers we all know you're not going to get the answers you're looking for at this exact moment so the fact that you're there you're in the wrong for being there at this moment and on top of that my personal opinion like i said i showed y'all the still frame you know what i mean like i remember seeing parents argue and like it's just the ugly scenario that's a like if I ever had a kid, that'd be a no-go. That'd be like, you would have to have, like, I'd have to be fighting you. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I'm not going to raise my voice, do all that, because that affects the kids. You know what I'm saying? Like, it's traumatizing. You know what I'm saying? Like, at least I think so. It's one thing when you're disciplining the kids and you're talking to the kids. It's another thing when a kid is watching you talk to a whole a whole adult. Like, it's scary. You know what I'm saying? At the end of the day, if you didn't want to leave, then baby should have been escorted out or something. Like, you should have told them kids to go somewhere or something. But then again, though, like, seems like there's something going on in terms of like the principal and like with this kid because she had grievances with the with the son there's definitely some personal going on in the video between her the mother and the person behind that desk over there but either way man you know breathe easy love the kids and i never like to see the kids looking all crazy like this so yeah you know i mean i like i want to ride with mama dukes but i don't have the full context all i see right now is you going crazy and them asking you to leave you know what I mean? But y'all gotta let me know what's shaking and baking in the comments section. Do you think this parent had every right, regardless of what the situation is? Or do you think that she really should have been outside the door for the safety of her and the kids and probably got those answers that she wanted to when she had cooler heads? You know what I mean? I always find that, you know what I mean? You better off getting it with honey than vinegar. But you know what I mean? That's just me. I don't know what's going on, but you already know the vibes. Like and subscribe. Thank you for the love and thank you for the subs, man. You already know what it is. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I really appreciate y'all. And don't forget to breathe. Eddie.